we have here is a speed up slow down tutorial um, usually that affects where you would see on drones where it will speed up well start off normal speed speed up then suddenly slow down so this is the footage what you see i'm just going to quickly just scrub through it just to get a feel for where my starting point is going to be for the drone and i'm just going to play it scrub it through a bit okay that's where it ends all right but my drone tent i'm getting the landing shot i don't want the landing shot i just want the peak of my shot um, sometimes i'm quite fussy for the sake of the tutorial you actually see me being less fussy but I want to get it at a certain point where it's towards the best bit of the shot to use for when I'm going to use this video. So we'll try that again. We've chopped it. So we're going to cut it here because that's going to be the starting of the shot. The first three seconds played at normal speed. Then I want to chop it there and then click the right click and then speed and duration. And then I'm going to just pick, say, a thousand times the speed. And then the remainder of the shot, I drag that closer. And then I'm going to change that speed to, say, 50%. Have that going at half the speed. And we'll just play that through. We'll give it a quick scrub. There we go. Alright, I think I'm pretty happy with that for now. So we're just going to quickly render it. If anything, I should speed this up in the video. But I'm going to let you just <laughs> watch it render. Um, so let's just have a look and see how that works. There we go. It's got a bit boring now, so I'm going to chop that backwards as well. You know how attention spans are with videos too long, it's boring, too short. It's, you can't capture it. Um, let's just additive dissolve. I'm chucking in there. Um, this, I didn't get perfect. But it's just for an idea of what you usually see with many drone videos you see. They do their speed up, slow down effect, and when it goes to slow back down, they'll have an additive dissolve. This one was a bit quick. Um, throughout the video, you see me keep changing it until I was happy with it. And believe it or not, I was probably still happiest with it at the start when I should have just left it as 4 out of 25 frames, but go figure. It's just me just messing with it to get it to a point. Then eventually... I'm going to see it get to where I want it to get to. Now, let's see, the problem is why I keep changing it is with this sort of transition, I know I could have used a better one, but I like additive, but if I catch it at the right point, it would look exactly as I want it to look. I just want the right amount of flash as it changes and dip to white is an overkill flash so I like additive dissolve that was a nice amount of flash I got there so I'll probably just leave it as that and call it a day hope you enjoy watching let me know if anything else you need to know